This video could change your life. In fact, it's actually changed my life. Hi, I'm Jen. Welcome to my weight loss and food channel. Welcome to something different. hello guys welcome to my channel welcome to my kitchen so i've showed my face today because you guys have requested for me to show my face in my food video so yeah i'm happy to show my face i'm happy to see you guys and i'm happy you guys have tuned in so today's video is another what i eat in a day i'm going to be showing you exactly what i eat if you're new here i'm all about food weight loss fitness workout exercises i'm on a weight loss journey i'm still on my weight loss journey so i basically show you what I eat to lose weight, what I eat that works. Still eat my normal food, but a different way of cooking it. I'm here to show you exactly that. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please make sure you do because it's gonna help my channel a lot. And today, we are making fresh fish pepper soup. This fresh pepper soup, you guys, is a fat burner. I'll be using ginger, garlic, basil leaves, Congolese pepper, hot pepper, all those things will literally burn and melt away a lot of belly fat. So it's very good. If you're interested in knowing how I make this delicious but fat burning pepper soup, make sure you watch this video to the very end so you can learn as much as you can. Anyway, let's get into my fridge. I'm going to show you exactly what I'll be using to make this pepper soup dish. Get into my Preach. do not judge do not judge don't come for me you guys just leave my fridge alone <laughs> okay <laughs> hey, this is my fridge you guys I'm going to be using tilapia this is what I'm using for my fresh fish is the tilapia I've always used a, a tilapia for this dish Some people use catfish to make um, fish pepper soup if there's any other type of fish that you guys have used for your fish pepper soup do let me know so that I can um, try it we're going to be using garlic basil leaves you guys this is optional but I'll be mixing it with um, another type of leaf called um, scent leaf and this is scent leaf I need to chop it up and slice it into tiny pieces I'll be mixing these two together in my pepper soup we are also going to be using some hot pepper pepper soup cannot do without having pepper in it the one we're going to be using is Congolese pepper I'll mix just a little bit a tiny bit of this I'll be using in the pepper soup as well and then we have ginger the last one pepper soup spice yep that's it before we do anything we need to prep prepare everything that we need to use to make this dish like the garlic the ginger the onions with the basil leaves and the scent leaves i'll be chopping them into little tiny pieces all the ingredients we're using today guys has got loads of weight loss benefits like the basil for example basil help to rev up your metabolism and it also helps to burn a lot of calories at a faster pace and then you have your scent leaf your scent leaf burns fat it reduces calorie level effectively and deals with excess fats. Some people add scent leaf in all the dishes that they cook. If you do that, that is a very, very good decision. Just to also mention you guys, scent leaf is normally green. The area that I live is difficult to find scent leaf. So this is the one I could find. This is the color for it. So I've chopped them in little pieces and it's ready. And then we have garlic. Garlic is good. We use it to cook all the time. It also helps to lose fat, you guys, because it flushes away the toxins from the digestive system. And then we have the ginger. Ginger also helps to enhance weight loss, it reduces feelings of hunger. And you know what that means? Less calories. 
So you see why I call this a fat burning pepper soup. It's got everything, everything that enhances weight loss. Everything I need is ready. My fish has been cleaned and descaled. Scent leaf and basil leaf is been chopped into little pieces. Onions, ginger, garlic is ready. And then my Congolese pepper and pepper soup spice. This dish is very easy to cook, you guys. The first thing you do in a blender, you combine your garlic, ginger, onions, and your pepper add some water and rough blend it and then place a pan on a medium heat adding all your fish make sure you use a white pan so the fish is not on top of each other and then adding your salt and your seasoning you can cover it and simmer without adding water for at least three minutes After three minutes, you can now add in your blended mix. Add in your pepper soup spice. And your Congolese pepper. Now add in some water, water should be like 4 to 6 cups of water or just to the top level of the fish, stir a little bit, taste and adjust for seasoning. Cover and simmer for further 12 to 15 minutes. The fish should be cooked through now. The last thing to do is stir in your scent leaf and your basil leaves. Cover and simmer for a further one minute and your pepper soup should be ready. that's it for the video you guys that's the end of the video i hope you enjoyed watching it if you watch this video to the very end i love and appreciate you for doing that thank you so much and please don't forget to like and subscribe have a nice day i put in way too much effort guess you thought that you could let up but even that wasn't enough to make you stay and I can't help but feel so stupid And I know that I'll get through this But we both know I didn't want it to end this way And 
is crazy because I thought you'd be the rest of my whole life And I hate that in reality you didn't even want to try And I hate that I know that my heart will end up more broken than yours will ever be And it's crazy because we both know that I really deserved the best But it makes me so mad because I knew you were capable of that But you convinced yourself that you were not And at the end of the day, that's not my fault